EFNN, The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman on this Wednesday, Wednesday, the 25th of September, almost wrapping up the month. Amazing. And quite a month this has been. You can see this monthly chart on the right in the Dow. And you've got the weekly chart right in the Chapman Wave inside track repellent zone. Daily chart has gone to a new all time high of 42,299 for this Tiger Financial News Network 10 o'clock market update. We're looking at the Dow down 90 at 42,113. The S&P, this is going to be fascinating, squeaked to a new high. I've been calling this a consolidation over the last week or so, rotational correction. Uh, not really correction, but just rotation. And you can see for the past four sessions, we've really, we've made new highs here. But these are tiny little candles. If you look at the QQQ, here we go, QQQ. Um, that is the index 100 trading vehicle making a leg D. And that D has just gone to a new recovery high, but not an all-time high, which is at 503.52. We are 486.89, up $1.54. Nice action, improving in the weekly chart. The IWM was a little weak, and still a little weak, down $1.45 at 219.75. I hope this is just a breather because all the technicals are still strong, but it hasn't been picking up over the last one, two, three, four, five, five sessions where the general market has been the down, the S&Ps have been going to all-time highs. This is kind of stalling. So we're looking at gold. <clears throat> Gold's gone to a new all-time high at 2,685. Very nice action. You know, not all the gold stocks are performing like this. But anyway, this is very strong. I want to go to bonds because it's so important. Bonds are weak. Down over a half a point at 124.5. Wow. The, you know, Fed comes out, lowers rates, and the rates go higher. <laughs> Something's wrong with this picture. Look at the crude oil. Crude oil trading right. Crude oil trading right now down uh, at 70.72, down 84 cents. This kind of stalling way under the 200 p.m. moving average of 73.29. Let us go to, oh, I want to look at high-grade copper. High-grade copper is trading uh, up a tad at 4.5. Nice action. I'll be back for the Tiger Technicians Hour in a moment. And check out my opening call, Dating Music.